Hey everyone, good evening. It's Jay, Mr. Real Estate Morrison here. I'm super excited. We just got off a packed webinar. We had over <laughs> uh, nearly 1,500 people register for our webinar tonight on uh, how to force value in apartment buildings. My partner, Chris Ursula and I went over a 90 minute long webinar teaching this stuff and also giving everyone a great opportunity to engage us for three days down in Atlanta, Georgia, which I'll talk about in a little bit. But um, the most exciting part about it at all, this is actually a formula I did for an A-list celebrity client of mine uh, who plays in the NFL, pro bowler, multiple time pro bowler, uh, who's gonna be getting into the apartment game with us, acquiring buildings, acquiring anchor properties, and building a legacy for his family. So for those of you who don't know me, uh, I'm the CEO and founder of the Jay Morrison Academy. I'm also the CEO and leader of the YMC Community Coalition. Uh, I'm an NBC's real, uh, expert uh, on the Today Show for real estate, right? NBC's real estate expert, as well as celebrity realtor, uh, millionaire, for those of you that, 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 that matters, um, serial entrepreneur, coach, mentor, social activist, father, dad, Christian, and a whole bunch of other stuff, right? So anyway, um, in regards to how to force value in real estate, what does that mean? How do you force value, right? So what I call it is, um, it's forcing your dreams to come true, right? Your dreams is that your properties will cash flow for you. You'll make monthly rents that will pay for your lifestyle and your expenses. So you can have all the cars, jewelry, girls, vacations, big weddings, colleges, whatever it is you want to do. You can force the value of properties to be able to pay for your lifestyle and live the life that you want to live. But you have to go into the properties with the right strategy and implement that strategy, have the right exit strategy, and most importantly, you have to buy right. You have to buy low and buy right. So I'm gonna to talk to you about how this is actually done with anchor properties. I'm gonna talk about anchor properties that are that, that means apartment buildings, right? So we are focusing on the apartment building game. We are teaching you what the 1% of the rich know. We are giving that back to the in the, the top one or say 10%, we're giving that back to the the bottom 90%, so to speak. We're giving that back to the middle class. We're giving that, I call myself Robin Hood. I steal the game from the rich and I give it back to the hood. I give it back to those who need it most, those who are trying to find a way in life, trying to find another way out, trying to build wealth and build legacies. My legacy lives with you all. Me teaching you how to build a legacy carries on my legacy, right? So let's get into the meat and potatoes of how you force value in an anchor property in an apartment building, right? So this is a little what we cover on the webinar. I'm giving you a short version because I'm excited. We, the, the, the people are registering already for our three-day conference. I'm going to tell you how to do that in a minute. But first, I want to give you some information. I want you to understand that how priceless this is and how you can utilize it and really how simple it is to learn. This is high-level stuff that no one teaches you. You go to these, uh, I don't want to even call any names, but you know all the gurus, right? You go to any of their courses, all their free stuff. Hey, you know, I'm such and such, such and such, and come to my free seminar. And they're going to teach you the same thing that we already teach you in the academy, how to wholesale, how to finance, how to buy and flip, how to buy and hold. Only thing is that we teach it for a lot less than the academy. You actually speak to me as your mentor, not some trainee. And I teach you how to brand yourself and build a national brand, right, which I've done for myself. Coming from poverty, welfare, high school dropout, three-time felon, I've been able to make a national brand for myself and become a multimillionaire. So I teach you that in my academy personally and not one of uh, you know some flunky I've hired to you know teach my strategies, right? So anyway, the academy is great for you real estate investors who want to stay in a residential game, but for those of you who want to learn how to force value, here's how it starts. Take a property, right? No purchase price. I don't care about a purchase price because I'm going to tell you what the purchase price should be on any property and how you analyze a deal. If you have a 32 unit property, let's say the rents are 900 per month, right? So we get, it's like 28,000, I think 800, right? A month. And we do that times 12, 12 months. Our gross potential rent for the year is $345,600, right? Now, if you have a 70% vacancy rate, uh, excuse me, occupancy rate, that means that just 30% of the units are vacant. So after we subtract that, we have 241,920. Now, whenever we want to calculate our expenses, our formula, right, with the J. Morrison Elite Apartment Coaching, our formula is we use 50% of our gross potential rent, our GPR, 50% of that, you see this arrow going there, 50% of this number is our expenses, taxes, insurance, SOAR, fees, whatever. Cool. That number is 172.8, right? So we're going to subtract from our gross, uh, our gross income, which is our, our gross potential rent minus our vacancy rate. 
We're going to start with our minus from our gross income, now our expenses, and we get our net operating income, right? Make sure you can read that. Our NOI, right? You all, you all heard NOI before. So your net operating income is your gross potential rent minus your vacancy rate, right? So write this down. To get your notepads, iPhones, whatever you do, I say use a notepad, go old school. But take your gross potential rent minus your, uh, your vacancies, and minus your expenses, you get your net operating income, your NOI. Now, we only buy at a 10% cap. So you uh, divide your net operating income by your cap rate, by 10%. Or you can multiply just times 10, right? So you divide your, your NOI by your cap rate. This is the actual value of this 32 unit, the as-is value, $691,200. That would be the only, I would not pay a penny more for this property than $691,200 for this 32 unit at the current state that it's in. But now let's talk about forcing value, right? How do we force value, create equity, and see if this deal is a great deal for us and for our family and for our portfolio and our clients? So through our research and market analysis, which we will teach you during our, our three-day training session, uh, I'm going to call it training session. That, that's an understatement. Our three-day conference, right? This is elite, top-level, A1 stuff. So during our three-day conference in Atlanta, what we're going to teach you is how you evaluate a market, understand the market trends, and see that this property is being undermanaged and can actually uh, have a rent increase of $50 per unit, right, per year. So when you go into an apartment building, some people are on their last month of the lease, some people on their first month of the lease, some people are in between, anywhere in between. But what you do know is that typically on six to 12 month leases, in one year, everyone's lease is gonna turn over. So we know in one year, we can up every rent by 50 bucks. So now we're at a $950 rent on the uh, you know uh, average rent per unit, same 32 units. And now because it's being undermanaged, right? So it was a property that was owned three generations. Now the grandson has it and he just loves partying in LA. He doesn't manage it well, doesn't hire great property managers. That's why you have a 70% vacancy rate. So with us coming in as experts, knowing how to hire prop, uh, um, property managers pro properly and how to actually sustain a relationship with property managers where we check on them weekly or bi-weekly or have the right Excel spreadsheets and systems in place to be able to manage our managers, right? So I don't manage a property, right? I'm a business owner. I manage the manager. When you buy an apartment building, it's your business, right? So I'm teaching you how to be a business owner here on a cash flowing property where you can force appreciation. So anyway... On your vacancy rate, we're going to bring that, that, that vacancy rate or occupancy rate. I, I don't know why we call it this. We do, which is just weird to me. I'm just going to say occupancy rate, right? So our occupancy rate, we're going to bring that up from 70% up to 90% with good management. So now there's more units actually filled, more paying tenants. So by doing such, our gross potential rent has now went up just by adding the 50 bucks times 32 times 12 our gross, our GPR is now up to 364, 800, right? Cool little profit, right? Not bad. So now when we take that minus our vacancy rate, which is now uh, lower, right? Our occupancy is now higher. So now we're not losing as much money per month. We've now increased our value to 328,320 as far as our gross income, right? So remember our GPR minus our uh, vacancy, which is now gonna have 10% vacancy, right? So it's less vacancy. We've now made more money per month and per year. So now we're at 328. So now when we take our expenses, 50%, same thing. So we'll take our expenses and we'll go up here. So 50% of our GPR, right? Right here, 1824. And so when we subtract our GPR minus the vacancies, we get our gross income. Gross income minus our expenses. Now we have 145,920. So we've now created a new net, same exact property. The same property you went in and we're only getting 69,000 a year in cash flow and, 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 and profit. That same property we brought to 145,000 a year of net operating income just by boosting the rents 50 freaking bucks and by doing better management, right? By executing and implementing better management and using our strategies that we teach you. So same 10% cap rate, right? We, we, that's our formula. So times 10 or divide or 145 divided by 10. 
And now we get 1.459, right? 1.45 million dollars, right? Of uh, of value, of uh, excuse me, of stabilized value, right? When we say stabilized, when a property is being undermanaged and is being under and, and underrented as well, it's unstabilized. Undermanaged, unrented equals unstabilized. Another note for you. So now when we manage it better and we rent it better, we're now stabilized. So our unstabilized value was 16, um, 691000 Our stabilized value is $1.45 million, which is a forced value increase or a forced value add or forced value created of 768000 on the same exact property you went into for 691000 right? So here's your forced value Here's your forced value add, three over three quarters of a million dollars by implementing small changes. And this is a short recap of a 90 minute webinar where the people that were on the webinar were so lucky to get a great breakdown from my partner, Chris and I. And you guys have now got a summary of that. And now I wanna tell you about the opportunity for you guys to come learn from us, learn our systems, get the worksheets, network with hundreds of other students, be at our conference in this beautiful ballroom at the Marriott Marquis in downtown Atlanta, May 15th through 17th, Friday through Sunday. We're doing a reception Friday night, right? Private reception just for us to mingle, network, let loose, loosen up our ties, right? And we're gonna have a lot of fun where we're gonna get a lot of education and a lot of learning. Who do you know knows this stuff? And if you knew them, why haven't you learned it yet? Right. So very few people, especially in the middle class, in the minority community, underserved community, know this information. Very few people even in the in the, the, the fluid community know this information. This is secret privilege stuff that I don't care about sharing because my legacy lies within you executing and learning this this information. Right. So I'll give you the information. But now this is a strategy. But now we have to teach you how to actually implement it. How do you get the managers? Where do you find them? Just all the details, the minute details of how you actually pull this off. So Chris and I, Chris Urso, my partner, we're going to show you this in Atlanta. And it's going to be $30,000. No, I'm complaining. It's not. It's for the weekend, right? I know you're thinking, Jay, okay, it's not $30,000, but it's $10,000. Okay, it's $5,000 for the weekend. I know what you guys do. You're a guru. No, I'm not. I'm not those other guys. It's not $1,000 for the weekend. It's only $497, not per day, $497 for the entire weekend, three days with Jay, me, and my top advisors studying the most highest level of real estate on how to buy anchor properties and, and, and leverage and create a legacy for your family, for your future, for your kids, 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 kids. 497 bucks for the whole weekend. And on top of that, because I'm that dude, for the 497, for the first 50 people that registered, it's getting close. And I'm, I'm probably gonna extend it. I'm a nice guy. I'm, I'm a philanthropist. So, but right now, for the first 50 people that register at register, no, excuse me, go to jmorrisonlive.com. For the first 50 people that register, you get to bring a guest for free. So now your 497 for the weekend is being divided by two, and I get to bring a free spouse, partner, guest to the event to learn this so you guys can implement it together. That's like 86 bucks a day or something like that. So you not like, this is the most highest level of real estate. You know the value I just gave you in this video. I'm going to oversell this. So listen, if you're smart, you want to take advantage of an opportunity on how to do this the right way, the J way, and how to build a legacy for your family, just come to Atlanta. I'm going to be live. Chris is going to be there. Most of my students are going to be there. jmorrisonlive.com. Come check us out. Come learn the next level of real estate for somebody that's about the people. All right. So anyway, love you guys. I'm excited to do this. I know you get a passion in my voice. Let's buy assets, things that make us money. Right. So anyway, enough of that. See you on the next video. JMorrisonLive.com, Atlanta, May 15th through 17th. It's going down, baby. Uh, 497. You get to bring a partner if you hurry up. And we're going to have a ball. And we're going to learn a lot. And um, that's it. JMA, YMC, New Role Models. Peace.